Hi, I'm Trisha Friedman, and I want to talk to you today about how we can use AI to provide some personalized coaching. So on the screen, you see our Shifting Schools mega prompt for a motivational speech. So this is a template where you can prompt a tool like ChatGPT to please craft a powerful motivational speech that draws from, then you specify the type of experience and offers inspiration to specify the type of audience or the person, share a, give a specific type of anecdote of overcoming. You can specify the type of challenge, highlighting how you manage to, and that's a great place to identify the verb. Incorporate key themes of, again, select your themes or concepts, offer practical advice and actionable steps to help the audience achieve, specify your goals, use storytelling techniques that are stylistically similar to, here's where you can identify a genre of film or music, or even specify a film director to captivate your audience and leave them feeling, select your emotion or emotions, your voice should mirror. Again, you can pick a style and not. Here's a great place for you to optionally identify a style you don't like. Throughout, please I'd address the audience as, and there's where you can put a name or names and community. All right. So what does that actually look like in action? Um, this is the sample that I did where I asked for a motivational speech that draws from experience starting a new school and offers inspiration to a 15 year old student share a sports anecdote based on snowboarding of overcoming a sports injury, highlighting how you managed to learn to end up appreciating a new sport, incorporate key themes of courage, friendship, and triumph over personal fears, offer practical advice and actionable steps to help the audience achieve moving forward in an emotional time. Use storytelling techniques that are stylistically similar to Ryan Coogler movies like Creed to captivate your audience and leave them feeling hopeful. Your voice should mirror Silk, also known as Cindy Moon, and not mirror Batman. Throughout, address the audience as either Jesse or JJ or Jesse the Magnificent. Whew. Here's what ChatGPT came up with. So now I've got a script for a motivational speech, but what if I wanna take that script a step further? Well, if you have heard of the tool 11 Labs, this is a space where we can go to generate voice AI. Um, you can try it out free. They do have a free subscription option. So what I did is I've got my subscription. I thought about the voice library I explored some of the options. There are many, many options in the voice library. And I should mention, once you have selected one, you can further customize it. So I've selected my voice. I've added it to the text. I click generate. It's going to then produce the audio file, which I can then download and actually listen to. So. Are you ready to listen to what that motivational speech sounds like? Here we go. Today, I want to share a story that might resonate with some of you, especially you, Jesse the Magnificent. I remember being 15, just like you, JJ, and facing one of the most challenging experiences of my life, starting a new school. You see, it was a lot like stepping onto a snowboard for the first time. I was excited yet terrified, wondering if I'd make friends, fit in, and find my place. The slope ahead seemed steep, and the uncertainty of the terrain was daunting. But as they say, life often throws us into uncharted territory, and it's up to us to find the courage within. Now, speaking of snowboarding, let me share a sports anecdote with you. I once had a passion for it, much like some of you might have for your interests. But one day, I suffered a nasty injury, a fall that left me shaken, both physically and mentally. The fear of getting back on the board was overwhelming, and I doubted if I'd ever find the joy in it again. But Jesse JJ, let me tell you about triumphing over personal fears. I realize that courage is not the absence of fear, 
but the willingness to face it head on. I took one step at a time, surrounded myself with friends who believed in me, and with their support, I conquered that mountain of fear. Just like in those Ryan Coogler movies, it was about finding strength in the face of adversity, believing in yourself, and building friendships that could withstand any storm. As the great Rocky Balboa once said, it ain't about how hard you hit, it's about how hard you can get, hit, and keep moving forward. So, my advice to you, Jesse the Magnificent and all of you here, is this. Embrace the unknown. Starting a new school or facing any challenge is like carving your own path on fresh snow. It may be tough at first, but with determination, you'll leave your mark. Make friends who uplift you, support one another, and never be afraid to ask for help when needed. Remember, life's like a snow-covered mountain, filled with twists and turns. Sometimes you'll fall, but that's when you learn to appreciate the beauty of the climb. You are capable of so much more than you know, and courage is your greatest ally. So, as you navigate these uncharted slopes, believe in yourself, JJ, and remember, you're Jesse the Magnificent. The world is waiting to see the incredible journey you're about to embark upon. Keep moving forward, and may you find the triumph that comes from within. Thank you. So now, interestingly, I've got um, an MP3 file that I can send to myself. I could keep that on my phone. I could listen to it when I want. And now I'm thinking about the ways that I would work with my students to help them identify what is a challenge where you could just use a little additional coaching for, where you can create a kind of custom made message for yourself for you to listen to when times feel hard um, or you know that your friend is going through a little bit of a tough spot. Could you send them a motivational speech in voice format? So I think that's kind of an interesting creative way to be exploring AI. And then again, looking at its limitations. I, as a, a teacher, I might walk my students through that process and say, how can we make this script better? Because was that script perfect? No, nope. it's a decent rough draft. But how, what can we do to continue to work on that draft so it really feels closer to the support and the coaching that we need? Thanks for watching.